Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a very exciting Hermes haul. And one thing I hate about haul videos is when people start with the most boring item. So today we're gonna start with the most amazing item, which I've been dying, dying to get. So, this is actually purchased from a reseller. You guys can see it is a very teeny tiny box. Comment down below if you think you know what it is. I will just say a majority of the stuff is a home haul, but this one particular item I had requested from my reseller who is absolutely amazing. She literally can get me any bag that I want, obviously for a premium price. This was something which I knew I needed, particularly for this season, and the color is perfect, the size is perfect, and I'm just so excited about opening this one because this one is brand new, box fresh, and I haven't seen it yet, I've seen pictures. Here we go. <laughs> wow. Obviously inside you've got the care card and I didn't get the receipt for this, unless it's in the bag. Here we have my new mini Kelly. This is in the color rose lipstick and oh my God, it's absolutely stunning. I am obsessed. In fact, I do actually have a bag in this color. So this is my little Birkin 25 in Clement's Lover. I absolutely love her. And we've had her for a while. She's so beautiful. I love wearing this color. It's just such a lovely, fresh color. And this is the Kelly 20. It's in a completely different leather. So I feel like the colors are actually a little off in terms of the leather. This is actually a newer model, whereas this one is a little bit older. I'm not too sure how old this is. The fact that she's got the stamp, I can't really make out what that is, but the fact that this one's got the stamp on this little strap thing shows that it is actually pretty old, whereas the newer models tend to have the serial code on the inside of the bag, as I'm sure the majority of you already know, but this is a 2020 Box Fresh Mini Kelly with gold hardware. I'm obsessed, like, I really wanna start injecting more color into my wardrobe through my bags, particularly like small Kellys. I feel like they're just the perfect pop of color, particularly for summer, and I could not let this one pass up. The leather is actually quite soft. It's so cute. And these actually do fit an iPhone in them, so obviously inside we have the teeny tiny strap, like, look how thin this is. It's so cute. I'm just obsessed, it's so cute. How do I take this? I've seen people like put twillies on their mini Kellys, but I, I don't really feel like I need to really. Uh, I've also seen people put little tiny rodeos on their Kellys. Is it a rodeo or is it a rodeo? <laughs> I mean, I'm British, so we say rodeo. So this is what she's like with the strap on. So cute. And you guys can see the inside completely brand new. You can actually get these custom made with like different colorways, but obviously, since I'm just collecting a few now, I just wanted to keep them quite simple and basic. Oh, this actually matches my outfit. I might wear this tonight. This is so cute. I am obsessed. I absolutely love this. I'm so excited to wear this. Like, you guys have no idea how long I've waited for a mini Kelly for. Like, I've seen the previous vintage styles. I really love those. Those have, like, a slightly bigger handle. And they've got, like, a completely different look to them. I love those, but I really wanted these. I love these and I love the Kelly pochettes. Those are very similar to these, just they don't have a strap. But I feel like these are just younger, they're fresher, they're more versatile. And, oh, it's just so cute. I am so happy to have this color. And obviously, because I'm having a mini Kelly moment, I did actually pick up another bag before I saw this one and that just recently came. So let's do an unboxing of that. This one actually is pre-loved. Obviously, the boxes are completely different. This one's brand new, box fresh from the store. This one I actually bought from one of my favorite trusted reseller websites. They do an amazing selection of like pre-loved Hermes. They have like a proper authenticator. And I just couldn't resist. When I saw this, I saw the price tag and I was like, I just, there's something about red Hermes bags that I just really love. I think the best part of 2020 for me has been injecting color through Hermes bags into my wardrobe. So here we have my other mini Hermes Kelly and this is in color tomato. 
tomato 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 i believe it's a tomato red and she is absolutely stunning this one is actually a 2060 model but it is literally almost exactly the same as this one the only real difference is the leathers i don't know if you guys can see the pink has more of a slightly smoother leather whereas the red is more of a grain leather. Both are actually quite supple. They do look like they're quite sturdy, but the leather is soft. It's not like super stiff, which I like. I wasn't, ex I was actually expecting them to be quite like stiff, but I'm really pleased that they're not. I think they're both so adorable. I absolutely love these bags and I'm just obsessed. Like honestly, I'm not someone that keeps a lot of things in my bags, which is why I tend to gravitate more towards 25 Birkins and 25 Kellys, but I think oh this still has like a sticker on it um obviously it doesn't have all the stickers on it i don't really keep a lot in my bag unless i'm going somewhere i've got something like really important to do i need to lug around a laptop or a hairbrush obviously a hairbrush really isn't gonna fit in this but does she still have shoes on no she doesn't have shoes the, sh the feet are a little bit slightly tarnished but not really there is slight signs of like discoloration on the handle there but it's not really that evident there's no like color transfer on the back or the front this is literally in almost pristine condition it's so beautiful and oh, i just love it it's so cute you're so tiny so we're just gonna take off this little sticker every time i buy a bag that's pre-loved i've always seen the sticker on now i'm thinking should i keep my stickers on is that what it's on the inside there is a little bit of I feel like they're just like mild scratches, but that's okay. No one's really gonna be looking at the inside of my bag. I'm just like, oh, my little babies. I'm so happy. I can't deal with this cuteness. Like they're so cute. And you guys know, I am strictly a gold or a rose gold hardware kind of girl. I do feel like I need to get into palladium hardware a little bit more. This is even a cute little vibe. I would definitely wear this out. It's like the Chanel double bag vibe. <laughs> Hello, my little children. Okay, let's move on to the less exciting things, which are still pretty exciting for me. I asked my Hermes reseller if she actually had any blankets or pillows because we've literally just redone the entire house. And we have this amazing sofa downstairs, which I'll show you guys. And my mom's actually put me in charge of redecorating, which is fun. Like I absolutely love interior design. My sister's studying it. I just tend to just visualize things. I just had a vision for the downstairs and I was like, it needs these Aramaz pillows. So, Jess came through with these beautiful tan Aramaz pillows. We have these beautiful pillows in our London home and they are so amazing. They're actually cashmere. They're so lovely. These do come in so many different colors. I might just get some for my bed, but I don't feel like I really need to. I'm, I'm not someone that has like a thousand pillows. I have four. This is the first. And then, Obviously, you can't just get one pillow. <laughs> if it's a massive sofa, you can't just put one Hermes pillow on it. So we have another one. And finally, a third. So we have three beautiful Hermes caramel kind of toasted caramel pillows. I love these. I do really love the orange as well and the black, but my mum's super against black and white downstairs like she's just finds it too harsh and she's more like a bohemian kind of vibe and i was like okay the brown is nice it warms the place up brings everything together so we love the brown and obviously <laughs> no pillow set is complete without the blanket so i got a blanket i i love these so much they're like the perfect blanket to just throw on when you're like on the sofa, chilling. They're so nice and snuggly. I did actually get the matching set. I'm not someone that likes to um, mix and match. It probably would have given me anxiety. But here we have this beautiful Hermes blanket. And they're so cuddly, I love these. I do really love the Dior home stuff as well, but it's just not the vibe that we were going for downstairs. I might keep one of these pillows up. I oh, know, I'll just get another one. I, I love them. I would definitely highly recommend them. If I'm able to find these online for less, I will definitely link them down below. But if you are considering it, bite that bullet. It's definitely worth it. Particularly if you live in like a 
colder country in the UK especially I know that these would come so handy I just love snuggling up on the sofa with my blanket and just they're just so warm and I think that's really important for like furnishing it should be comfortable and cozy and I'm just not someone that's into that cold kind of vibe when it comes to a home I think it's nice to have a homely vibe I don't know if that makes sense to any of you guys. Ever since I got my own place, I've really got into like decorating and creating my little home, which has been such a fun part of 2019 for me. If you guys haven't already seen, I got my first apartment. I will link that video down below. But yeah, that basically summarizes my little haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope I didn't ramble on too much about random things. I'm so excited about these bags. I cannot wait to wear them. I will do a review on them if you guys do want one, but I feel like a lot of people have done reviews on Kelly 20s and there really isn't much to them. They're just a small bag, which is so beautiful. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you do want to see more, make sure you tap that subscribe button, hit that bell to get notified every time I upload and follow me on Instagram. I will see you guys in my next video.